What's up, everybody? I am your bearded, I'm gonna add bearded to the intro now, bearded nootropics information wizard. Thanks so much for being with me. Check us out on the web at livecortex.com. Is the mic right? Yeah, the mic's good. Livecortex.com slash blog. Look, giant blog for nootropics information. It could be at number 88, podcast number 88. We've got a podcast, the Cortex Labs Nootropics Podcast. It's the most informative podcast on nootropics on the planet. We've got 77 episodes as of this filming, but it could be 88 or 84 by the time you're watching this. Uh, they're all free. They're all audio. They're all awesome. Livecortex.com slash blog. Check us out on Facebook. Like us, please. We need more likes. Facebook.com slash Cortex Stacks. Every shred of information we put out on this channel is supported by six products. I'm going to run through the specials on those products for those of you that care about that. And then we'll get right to the content of the video. Here they are. Elite level nutrition. All right, number products. one, the Cortex Stack right now is still on sale. We're doing coupon code five takes it down to 27 bucks. The Cortex Stack is a motivation, mental energy, verbal fluency, productive drive stack that we built for elite level business folks, but everybody else likes it. Get it at livecortex.com. If you need my help personally, we've got a consulting service. It's a Skype call with me for 40 minutes. Most people just drill me with questions about nootropics and then help have me help them figure out stacks that turn their brain on. Uh, coupon code five, get you five bucks off of that. And if you're new to nootropics, buy Smarter, Better, Faster. That's our digital book. You can download it. That teaches you everything you need to know about nootropics. It is the, it is the prime book for nootropics on the web, kind of in the world right now. Get that stuff at livecortex.com. Okay, so quickly paraphrasing an email that came through. Uh, somebody just sent an email and said, hey Ryan, I travel a lot for business. I'm wondering what's the most convenient way to take nootropics while traveling, and specifically what kind of nootropics do you take while traveling? And I think there's two, there's two major things that I would say there. Number, the, the first one would be very specifically a compound called adrafinil. Adrafinil is one of the best compounds to travel with. And then secondly, uh, generally, just to give you the two categories, you want to shoot for sublingually administerable nootropic compounds. So sublingually administerable nootropic compounds just refer to uh, compounds that require such low doses, doses to get effective results that you can put them under your tongue and let them dissolve under your tongue. That's what sublingual means, for those of you that don't know. You put a particular powder under your tongue and those veins there absorb your saliva absorbs the compound directly into your bloodstream it's still i believe going to get filtered in the liver at some point maybe maybe not it all depends somebody else who's like up on that type of physiology might be able to inform me on that or you or anyone else in the comment section uh but suffice it to say the effect is very pronounced the effect onset so the onset time how long it takes for the nootropic to start affecting you is typically quicker via that administration and uh, the effects seem to be a little more pronounced, at least in the beginning. So that's the two categories. You want to shoot for you want to shoot for atrafinil, particularly because it's legal. It's considered a supplement, and it's very easy. And you don't necessarily have to take that, you know, sublingually. You can, and you can YouTube search taking sublingual adrafinil, and I've got a video on it. We've got a video on it for sure, and it's an awesome video. And I did it, and it was awesome. It like actually worked. You know, like adrafinil, you typically have to process in your liver and turn it into modafinil. But this means if you can take it sublingually, it must be active somehow in affecting people somehow just in its current form. Or maybe the liver metabolizes it anyway. Again, I don't know about that. So uh, so those are the two categories. I mean, look, yeah, you you have 150 milligrams or 300 milligrams of adrafinil and you're like in a pinch somewhere and need good brain performance, it's really gonna change the game for you. It'll substantially be a great nootropic benefit and, and, and you know solution in that situation. Can't tell you how many business folks that are into the Afinils and that don't that don't want to get a prescription for something like Modafinil, which prescription only compound, uh, or like can't get a prescription for it, they'd rather just take a su legal supplement in the United States or wherever they are. Adrafinil is legal in a lot of other countries. 100 to 350 milligrams of Adrafinil and they're totally in, get their brain performance back, they're verbally fluent, they've got motivation and mental energy and they're just like killing it. Uh, so adrafinil is absolutely like a, a go-to. Every time that I've traveled for business where I've needed to take nootropics over the course of the last 10 years, I've always done these two things, adrafinil and then sublingual, sublingual, sublingually administerable nootropics. So let's switch to them for a second. Uh, one of the, the most powerful uh, and most like easy sublingually administerable nootropics there is, is well two analogs of the same thing, uridine monophosphate in 100 milligram clips 100 milligrams under the tongue of uridine monophosphate, pretty awesome. And then 25 milligrams or so of triacetyluridine, which is a sort of more 
bioavailable version of uridine. It's just a little more of a quicker onset, a little more absorbable. You know, it's just more acetylated, triacetylated than uridine, which means it basically absorbs better, probably crossing over into the blood brain barrier. Uh, the other thing you can do is 100 milligram clips of phenylparacetam. Phenylparacetam is not like caustic, which is where it burns, like pramiracetam, another racetam would absolutely give you chemical burns if you put it under your tongue. Uh, phenylparacetam sublingually actually does work well. 100 milligram clips of phenylparacetam is quite great. The other suggestions I have are the other two racetams that require low doses, which are fasoracetam and coloracetam. So the effects are a little different because fasoracetam is calming but focus inducing too. So there's some enhancement of the acetylcholine neurotransmitter system in the brain which helps you focus better and have better memory and have better processing capacity. But it also upregulates one of the GABA receptors, quite sure it's GABA B receptors. So it basically makes your brain more receptive to GABA which is an inhibitory calming neurotransmitter too. So you get this like processing capacity improvement and you get a you know and calm inducing sort of effect from the GABA work so it's kind of like a smooth it's like a great alpha state kind of focus that's faster racetam you can take it in five to 40 milligrams sublingually let it sit under your tongue for five minutes and then spit it out or swallow it doesn't matter and then color acetam which is a basically cholinergic sort of like nupept pretty good for memory focus processing capacity uh, speed of processing sort of in general that enhances the way that the brain takes choline, the complex B vitamin, and turns it into acetylcholine by improving essentially uptake of choline and synthesis of choline into brain neurons. It's a process called high affinity choline uptake. That's what coloracetam improves. So if you take that in five to 40 milligram quantities sublingually under the tongue, let it sit for five minutes and spit it out or swallow it, You've got your nootropic benefit. That those are really the solid takeaways. Now you could apply the sublingual administration strategy to aniracetam and oxiracetam too. Both of them can be taken sublingually without burning your tongue, but you'll require higher doses. Aniracetam will be 400 to 800 milligrams and oxiracetam will be basically 500 to 1000 milligrams. But I've done it all before and it's been particularly useful and helpful. And that's basically it for a choline source with racetams while traveling to keep it convenient in this convenient regard, you just wanna take choline by tartrate. Choline by tartrate is just a simple form of choline. You know, get 500 milligram capsules of choline by tartrate and just bring them with you. Take one each time you take a racetam and you're on your way. That's my strategy for traveling. It's two simple categories within which, you know, the sublingual administration category has, you know, particular racetams that allow one to just conveniently dose them and still get a positive effect. Okay, so thanks so much for asking that question. Ryan at livecortex.com. If you have any questions about nootropics, I'd love to answer them on air. It gives us content and stuff to talk about. It's really pretty awesome that folks are emailing us every day. Um, and that's it. If you need my help personally on any of this stuff, you've got a consulting service. That's really where it's at for a lot of folks. We do a lot of these daily. It's a 40 minute call with me, 15 additional email correspondence. It's typically we help folks find stacks that work really, really good for their brain. I work with you over a period of time, even after the call. Uh, fix brain fog, fix issues that you're having, help you to focus better. Uh, and then some people just drill me with questions for 40 minutes and you can do that too. Get the consulting service at livecortex.com. And if you wanna try our stack Cortex, now's probably the best time. Coupon code five gets you Cortex for 27 bucks right now at livecortex.com. It is a motivation, mental energy, productive drive nootropic compound that we made again for like hard charging business people that wanna get a lot done and need significant brain performance. If you're new to nootropics, buy Smarter, Better, Faster. That's our book that teaches you everything you need to know about nootropics, and we'll explain the rest of our stuff here in a second. Thanks for watching. What's up, everybody? Ryan Michael Bella here. Hey, thanks for watching the video. Look, we've got, uh, as it stands, uh, five primary products that I want to just explain to you. You heard us mention them during the video, so I'm going to break them down. Number one, from left to right, the Cortex Nootropic Stack. This is a, a cognitive enhancement stack that you really want to take the turn the lights on. Just to give you an idea, hardcore business folks that require 18 to 20 hours of brain function 
uh, take the Cortex stack. That's what we initially designed it for, but then like everybody in the nootropic sphere loved it. Uh, verbal fluency, speed of processing, motivation, drive to want to work. That's what the Cortex stack does. Moving right along, the Anaracetam uh, guide there. That is called the Beginner's Guide to Anaracetam. Breaks down 25 powerful Anaracetam stacks. Shows you how to use Anaracetam. It's essentially the everything guide to Anaracetam. Uh, long demanded. Folks asked us for it. We delivered. It is fully digital. Lots of powerful stacks. And then there's the nootropic stacks for the business professional. That's basically 100, right around 100 powerful uridine, modafinil, theocrine, aniracetam, oxiracetam, phenylparacetam, alcar stacks for business situations for the type of brain states that business folks need for sustained performance. Next is the racetam god guide. That is a high level every racetam guide, uh, you know, digital guide. We've got all the major racetams with accompanying focus stacks and memory stacks and speed of processing stacks. Uh, in that racetam. There's eight major nootropic racetams, and that guide explains all of them and accompanying stacks. Then there's the Nupept Pro Stack List. The Nupept Pro Stack List is a digital guide that explains oral, so just taking it by mouth, sublingual, taking it under the tongue, and then intranasal, spraying Nupept nasal spray in your nose, stacks. It's just a bunch of stacks, a giant stack list of Nupep stacks that are highly effective, pro-level uh, specific brain state inducing type of new pep stacks. That thing has been a hit out there with the market. And then last, there's Smarter, Better, Faster. Smarter, Better, Faster is the all around all everything nootropics digital guide. If you just want to learn everything, many racetams, modafinil, etc., get Smarter, Better, Faster. It's like the guide you need to know if you're new to nootropics to learn basically everything and to walk away knowing what you need to know on nootropics. Thanks so much for listening. Thanks so much for watching. Get this stuff at livecortex.com and rock on.